Mr. Chairman, ladies and gentlemen, good afternoon. I'm very glad to have this opportunity to attend the conference. I'm honored to have the chance to address you on this special occasion. The title of this paper is Research on the Rubber Futures Price Discovery Function and Guiding Mechanism in China and Japan. This time, I will report from the following major sections. The introduction is divided into five parts. Introduction of research background and literature review, research approach and significance, article framework, research process and data analysis. Conclusion. The first part is the introduction of research background and literature review. The research on the function of the futures price discovery at China and abroad has a long history. In the process of speech, the definition of the function of price discovery will be determined first. And on this basis, the empirical research will be carried out to further illustrate the significance of studying this function through model construction, test, and analysis. Beckman focused on the simple linear regression model and concludes that the future price could not predict the spot price due to the maturity and they found that the non-stationarity of the current and spot price series would bring the regression. So the traditional OLS method of the test and analysis was questioned. After Eagle and Granger put forward a core integration test, it provided an effective way to test the non-stationary price series. Then, on the basis of the core integration test series, VR models was developed. According to the connotation of the price discovery function in the paper, research on the price discovery function of China's future market, Xie Xiaomei points out that the future's price reflects the participants' views on the relationship between the market supply and the demand, and the price is highly sensitive to the market, which can better reflect the prediction results of the many traders. The improved nonlinear grandeur causality test is used to study the representative varieties of China's financial model, architecture, futures market. The paper, The Church on the Relationship between the Natural Rubber Futures and the Spot Price in China, an empirical analysis based on the core integration theory. They used in 2003 to 2013 of the China Natural Rubber Future Market and the Cash market daily price data. Using VR model, core integration test and the causality test, impose response analysis and variance decomposition analysis method. Duty angle and comprehensive on the relation between the two empirical studies and propose that future perfect the conclusion of the natural rubber future market. Center measures and suggestions. In the paper, research on the function of the rubber features price discovery in China, Ecov used the 2,365 set of the rubber features spot daily trading data from the July 2010 to May 2020, and used the VEC model, grandeur causality test, variance composition, and the GS models and other research methods. The price discovery function of natural rubber futures in China is empirically analyzed. The second part is the research ideas and significance. In the above literatures, the construction of the models is mostly based on the analysis of futures and the sparse price over a period of time. In this paper, through the rolling compression of two five years periods from 2014, to 2019 and from 2015 to 2020, it's expected to show whether the price discovery function of natural rubber future market has been significantly improved. Due to the impact of the COVID-19, the overall global economic situation is declining and the import export trend has been hampered. Increasing many uncontrollable risks and the changes of the environment also deepens the complexity of the mechanism of the price action and hinder the effectiveness of price and information transmission. It makes more sense to look at recent price movements and ranges. As important industrial raw materials and national strategic materials, 
natural rubber is a typical resource constrained product, and its price has a great impact on the cost of rubber products such as tires. The research on the rubber features and spot features market and the mutual influence and the comparative analysis can feel can further realize the optimal allocation of source and make it easier or for rubber future varieties to go international. The third part is the framework of the article, which is divided into five parts. The introduction, overview of foreign exchanges and the current situation of rubber market in China, empirical study on the function and guiding the mechanism of rubber futures price discovery, the conclusion and the references the fourth part is the research process and data analysis, which is divided into six parts. Correlation analysis, ADF unit route test, established VR models, Johansson integration test, Granger causality test, variance decomposition. Firstly, the research method and data analysis was carried out to describe and analyze the correlation data centering on the current spot price and basis trend of data of natural rubber, so as to have the basic grasp of the current and spot market status of natural rubber to carry out ADF unit road test. Secondly, establish VR models on this basis. Johansson co-integration test is carried out, and then gradual causality test is carried out to judge the guiding relationship between the period and spot. Further, the variance decomposition is carried out, the proportion of the influencing factors are analyzed, and the conclusion are drawn for the price discovery function of natural rubber futures market. From the price chart, it can be seen that the price of the future and the spot first decreased slightly and then rose, showing a trend of constant fluctuations. The correlation co Efficient between the Japan Robo RS3 futures and the spot price is uh, calculated. It can be seen from the table 2 and that uh, the correlation coefficient between the Japanese Robo RS3 futures and the spot price in the first period is 0 0.9297 and that in the second period is 0 0.9282. Indicating that the both futures and spot price in the two periods are highly correlated. Moreover, the correlation degree of the futures and the spot price is greater than that of the domestic market and the transitively is closer. In this paper, a test model of the intercept and no time trend is selected for the stationarity test. Table 3 and Table 4 are the ADF test row results of the period first and second of the domestic rubber market, respectively. Table 5 and Table 6 as the AEF test the results of the period first and second of the Japanese rubber market. Thus, it can be seen that the futures price and spot price series in both China and Japanese are the same order. The VR models should be established between the Johansson coin regressions test. The pre-order lag period of the endogenous variables in the model should be specified so as to reflect the dynamic uh, relationship between of the all endogenous variables. In this paper, according to the VR model, the optimal lag orders of the first and second period of China rubber market is uh, 6 and 5 respectively, and the lag period of 6 and 5 respectively to establish the VRP models. According to the VRP models, the optimal lag orders of the Japanese rubber market in the first and second period is the 3 and 3 respectively, and the lag period is 3 and 3 to establish VRP models. Johansson Kong integration is conducted to analyze where there is a long-term stable equal relationship between the two. It can be seen from the table 7 and the table 9. Below that, the no matter trace value and maximum uh, income value test is adopted. A common conclusion can be drawn. The assumption that there is no co-integration relationship between the futures price and the spot price in China's rubber market is rejected at a significant level of the 5%.
and the assumption that there is no at uh, most one cointegration relationship is accepted. Gradual causality of the domestic rubber market in the first and two period. The BIOS test the results are shown at the table 11 and uh, table 12. According to the variance decomposition results of each variable during the period seen in the table 19 and 20, it is in the short lag period, the proportion of the future price affected by the shock from the spot gradually increased from the 0% in the first period to the 2% in the 100th period. The proportion of the spot impact from the future increased from 20% in the first issue to the 29% in the 100th issue. It can be seen that in a short cycle environment, the price of the Tokyo rubber market is more effective by the futures market than the spot market, and the futures market plays a leading role in the price discovery function. And the final part was the conclusion. The first conclusion is that the future price are highly correlated with the spot price and uh, in the both period. There is a long-term co-integration relationship between the futures price and the spot price. In a short period of time, spot future price has uh, the ability to guide the future price. In the long term, the future and the spot price has two ways guidance. The influence of the futures price on the spot price shows that the spot market dominates the price in the short term information trans transmission process. In the process of the long-term information transmission, the futures market plays a dominant role and uh, is the main driving force of the price discovery. The second conclusion is a comparative analysis at China and abroad. In the 21st century, with the rapid development of the global economy and the wide application of the rubber in the industrial field, rubber features also entered the period of the rapid expansion. In the recent years, the continuous recessions of the Japanese economy and the effects of the exchange system itself has impacted the Tokyo Com position as a pricing center. In particular, since the 2008 financial crisis, there has been a significant outflow of the market funds from Japan, and the pace of this market shrinkage has accelerated. At the same time, with the continuous improvement of the coverage, recognition and the participation of the SHFE natural rubber market, SHFE enabled rubber price has become the authoritative uh, quotation in the domestic ma market. And it also the most important quotation reference for the purchase and sales contract or pricing of the domestic rubber enterprise. Uh, the third uh, conclusion is that the development of the rubber, China's rubber futures uh, and the spot market uh, are pro progressing steadily, gradually maturing and depending the historical process of development. The Shanghai Future Exchange, SHFE, will also accelerate its development process, replacing the Tokyo Industrial Products Exchange and taking the core leadership to become the global natural rubbing pricing center. In order to promote uh, the development of the rubber industry and the bulk commodities, the state should be increased uh, support and further improve the rubber features and spot market. Uh, eventually, thanks for your listening and look forward to our next meeting. Thanks all.